seven seasons, the Utah Jazz, along with Mountain America Credit Union, been teaming up to pass it along. And they, you know, team up with charities along with the Utah Jazz, people that are giving back to do something special in our community. And tonight we kick things off with a very special story, uh, a group that's doing some really important things for children here in our state. Check it out. And happy to have you help us partner in such a great cause. Today, executives from two of Utah's most successful companies are making food packs. They'll go to children who might otherwise have little to eat over the weekend. I'm just saving you all really hard work. Kids Eat was started five years ago by Linda Brown while volunteering at a Boys and Girls Club. She was told about a girl who stole food from the pantry because she didn't have food at home. So Linda said, this can't happen, kids shouldn't go hungry. So she just went out and bought some food and made a little pack of food to take to the Boys and Girls Club, to the kids, and then discovered that the problem was much larger than just one child. We're really good at hiding poverty. The program caught the attention of USADA Corporation, which was looking for a charity with which to partner. So we go over there and we walk into this old pantry, this old school building, and on the floor we see all these food packs. And I just saw it and it was like, I got chills. I'm saying, this is something. This is something we're gonna get involved with. Now, Kids Eat and its volunteers provide 900 meal packs every weekend for hungry kids throughout the Salt Lake Valley. The success is why Mountain America is passing along $5,000 to Kids Eat. And today, the muscle of its executive team. So we're encouraging all of our employees to go out there, find a good cause and get behind it and help out. Always uh, great causes, stories. You see Kristen Kenny, Big T, throw Bailey down there with Sterling as they handed out that check to the Kids Eat program. By the way, the Kids Eat uh, program will also be opening a new expanded facility coming up next month. If you have a volunteer or a charity that you'd like to nominate, you can go to utahjazz.com slash pass it along.